Here. What we're doing here? Tell them what we're doing, everyone. Uh, we're having afternoon tea here. This is our afternoon tea. Uh, Blackpool <laughs> FC. Look at this. Tell you what. Look at that. I mean, I'd have it all. Look at that. The first time that Bradford played Blackpool was Boxing Day 1903, and. Uh, Bradford won one nil on that occasion. The last time we've played Blackpool was March 2019, and Bradford lost four one. Here is like where uh, Blackpool has like scouts and stuff. I feel like uh, newspaper strips that you might get in like Blackpool newspapers, and obviously program March 20, 2004. Uh, over here is an interesting one. Anglo-Italian final, look at that, Bologna v Blackpool, the 1971 Anglo-Italian Cup final, look at that, uh, over here as well, great one, the Wonga Player of the Month trophies as well, all sorts of little, yeah. It's a great little championship ground and if you look just over that stand there, you can see the tower just peeping out, uh, about 17,000 capacity though, brilliant ground, really is. And just by magic, you're going to next see us at Valley Parade in Bradford. <gasps> What's the magic word? Abracadabra! Oh, there, man. by magic, we're not in Blackpool anymore. In fact, we're at Lowmore train station. So for a bit of a change, here we go, there's the... There's the platform over going there. On the train? We're going on the train. Um, on, so, do you know what? Train. Trying different options. Broadway parking is two pound. It's cost us five pound fifty-five, I think it is, to go on the train. Both of us uh, return into Bradford. So we're heading to platform two now. Let's go. So, we've had a couple of dodgy results. Leighton Orient in the league, and we lost against Lincoln, 3-0 in the EFL trophy. Do you think we're going to get back onto winning ways today? I'm asking you as if you like the coach, aren't I, really? Not many, <laughs> not many people really care about EFL Cup. Harsh, but it's probably... Something, it's, something, it's something nice to win, and it is a trophy. But, but the priority will be on the league. Yeah, we've got to go hard in the league, and that's only one league this defeat so far this season. We're still third in the table, so I think uh, that we can go out and get a win there today. But my prediction is 2-0 to us. 2-0 home win, right, well, we shall see. Hey, that was moving quick, weren't it? It's ours coming now, then I'll give my prediction on the train. Ours is just coming in uh, right now. Dad, is it Hollywood now or something? It does look like the Hollywood sign, doesn't it, actually? Here it comes, Eric. 204. Say it to me, it's uh, a few minutes late. It's not late. I mean, early, it's early. It's early. So we're on the train, literally a seven minute journey into the interchange. Um, Your it's, prediction? It's prediction 1-1. One, one. I'd love to see us get back to anyways. I don't think it's going to happen today, but you, 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 like, you, know, you could be It's right. one game in a losing streak. It's acting as if we've been losing for the whole season so far. Two games, just two games. Let's count the EFL we, trophy. I'm not counting now, that's, that's just a bad thing. Well, no. we'll see I know right. it's a trophy and it's nice to win, but uh, yeah, we're third in the league still. So we'll next see you on the walk to the ground. Lovely, lovely view up there. Okay, so here we've got these people here on the train. 
win and they're going to predict the score for us first you go first home win yeah. Oh. I said that, I did say that. You said 2 0. I said 2 0. Yeah, you two said. Nil. Oh, I think it's 2 1. Oh, well, that's me looking daft, anyway. Go on. Carry on. Uh, next Jonathan. Oh, there's only me that's saying a draw at the minute, Eric. And you. I will say 2 1. 2 1. Oh, there, see, I did hear 2 1 somewhere. <laughs> and you were just saying off camera it's your first match first as well. Match. Oh, first match for all of you? Uh, not for me, no. Oh, that's so. Where are you going to be sat? Which stand are you going to be sat? Uh, oh, fantastic! That's brilliant. Enjoy it. And you got the scarf at the ready. That's it. Hey. We're at Bradford Interchange. Eric, this is for our quiz fans. What's the train called? William Shakespeare. But we are at Bradford Interchange. Nice easy ride to to the station. That was seven minutes. Look, Bradford Interchange. Here we are. Eric's got the program. Who do you say is on the front? Andy Cook? Walking down to the ground now. Not far away. Certainly busy going down Manningham Lane today, but it was dead easy on the train. Really easy on the train. I'd definitely use it again. It was really good. 20 minutes to pick up. Oh, hopefully it's a good game. Just found a bargain for Eric. Look at that Bradford City calendar, which he didn't have for 2021. Yeah, that's it. Bargain 25p. Listen, it's only 25 pence because that manager's been sacked. Well, yeah, but not that it's four four pitches left of the year. You know, 25p you can have that. Why not? So, September fixtures, Eric. Obviously, Walsall today. Then yeah. it's a tough away tie. Salford, Salford City. Uh, let me check where Salford are in the league. Here, and, and then the week after, back at home against Barrow. And then Crawley Town away. Uh, and I'll also, give you where all those teams are in the league. Walsall are at the moment. Walsall are 21st at the minute. So, so we should win. Should. Uh, uh, Salford, Salford City are 16th. Crawley Town at uh, 20th, so should be a good month. Uh, yeah. We've also got an EFL trophy match here against Manchester United under 21s uh, towards which the end of September as well, to, which we will yeah, be there for. long-range effort uh, we've played nearly 18 minutes uh, at the minute as it stands we are joint first with Forest Green Rovers they're nil nil in their game at the moment early days but a great goal from Elliot Watt really is one nil so half time one nil, uh, one nil it was for 41 and a half minutes then Jack Earing got the equaliser for Walsall, I'd say Walsall, 
Pierce Bradford. He did pierce it. I mean, I thought Walsall dominated for the first 10 minutes. Jack Earring's goal, and then, if that wasn't uh, any more drama, uh, the lead he got sent off for Walsall. Uh, I didn't really see the, the challenge, uh, but there's plenty of boost from the Bradford crowd. What do you think is going to happen in the second half? Uh, I think we can uh, get another goal. You think we Maybe can? Maybe get two more goals. Well, you, well, you'd think that, you know, 10 men, you'd think that, you know, it's, it's we advantage we Bradford, wouldn't you? We should do. But we'll see, we always make it hard for ourselves. We'll see what happens. You'll notice, Eric, that the floodlights are on. Seven minutes past four, a very late start to the second half. How do you describe that one, Eric? 1-1. One, one. Hey, sorry, but Daddy was right. <laughs> I mean, you could argue I would have kept Vernon on, like I just said off camera to you. Yeah. Uh, sometimes in the second yeah. half, he was putting his hand up, asking for the ball. Um, and he just the communication just didn't quite seem to be there at the front. Uh, anything you want to add to that? At least we stayed uh, for the whole the, match this week. At the end, we did play quick football, but Wal Walsall's defence was solid as a stir. Well, I tell you what, Walsall will go away with this. A point is like a victory, really, isn't it, with ten men? They'll be, they'll be ecstatic with that result. Bradford, it really is two points you know, two points lost. And at the end of the season, how, how crucial will those two points that we've lost today be? Only time will tell. After that 1-1 one, one draw, Bradford are third in the table. We hope that Forest Green and Harrogate drop points and we beat Salford next week. It's going first, but third does still mean automatic promotion. So who knows, we might be seeing League One football next season. I can't believe we're getting the lift up to the car park venue. Uh, thank you to everyone who, uh, the 500 people. 500 people who watched our first one. Let's try and get more than that for this one. And let's get 1,000 subscribers. Bye, and we'll see you when we play Barrow. We will indeed. Bye for now. Bye. Hope you enjoyed that Bradford City versus Walsall game now. Uh, Make sure you like and subscribe to the video. We are so close to a thousand subscribers, so we need to try and get there to there for well, it's September now, so the end of the month, possibly, because we've got another game in September we're going to go to. Uh, yeah, so like and subscribe to the video. 79 uh, subscribers we need to get uh, to a thousand subscribers. And we'll see you on the 18th of September for I think it's Bradford City versus Barrow AFC. Come on, the Bantams!